Mm. Wow, okay. Right. <laughs> I had a feeling you would ask sooner or later. It's because of that girl, isn't it? I am not Alidoro the Hound. Mm. Not the real one, anyway. I used to be Alidoro's partner. I admired him, to be honest. He was amazing. Amazing at everything, except making a profit, that is. But he didn't need to cut me off just because I sold some antiques. I mean, what's a few antiques when you've got bills to pay? We argued. One thing led to another. I had to kill him. But stealing his identity was the logical next step. My original code name is Parrot, after all. Fitting, isn't it? Oh, he was also from the country of the morning. Maybe he shares some blood with the girl. Wow. And that's my story. Tragic tale. Do you want to hear more? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. I'm just a guest here, with no special obligation to the hotel. But if you still want to hear... <laughs> The alchemist said they would help me escape from the city. Talk about an offer I couldn't refuse. I can't live in the hotel forever. I need to move up and move on. Also, there was someone who was so annoying. That's all. Does that suffice? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. So, oh, <laughs> good choice. I, Alidoro, am too great a treasure hunter to just disappear. My admirers would wonder. See for yourself. I sell only the best treasure. Jeez, you really could kill us, guy. Who? There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. That's a shame. Damn coward. So they say I can if I take him out, 
Choose to attack again. All you do is cryptic vessel, which you'll need to get to the meeting to it. Decipher. Next, read the description. Two dialogue options. I mean. Okay, so he said, if I do kill him, it'll lock me out. But I, I can talk to his fan to kill him. Uh, I mean, not kill him, but... Uh, so, I mean, I, I've essentially grabbed everything I needed from him, so... So... There should be something left at the dock. If anyone asks, I, I didn't see anything. Oh, what a murderous air you have. You're going to kill me? I know what you are. You're Geppetto's puppet, aren't you? If someone isn't trying to kill you, you can't hurt them either. That limitation makes it seem like your creator didn't trust you very much. Smart of him. So, what will it be, Mr. Handsome Idiot? Leave quietly? Or shut up and buy something. He really is a trash person. <laughs> You're like a human. Welcome, friends. May I be of service? Que bello! A brand new design. No, a whole new model. What a thrill! And there we are. Done. Even a brand new model doesn't stand a chance when you're dealing with genius. But the device bordered on genius itself. Required all my intellect. If you ever meet the creator, get me their calling card, won't you? No, oh, sorry, I'm sure you're busy. Just let me know if you ever find out. Hmm, Alidoro's cryptic vessel description. Dear beloved sister, please forgive your brother for leaving without telling you anything. I'm keeping this letter even though I don't know you know when I'll be able to send it. I'm being chased because I know the biggest secret of crap. I'll probably be able to see you if the alchemists are gone from this land, but I'll have to watch you from afar until that day. I plan to protect you at least, I mean, until at least we can live together, live in here in peace. Just like how I saved you from the workshop tower, it would be wonderful if people learn the truth one day. But some truths are better left unknown. Among the alchemists, I saw all too often how cruel, how cruel humans can become. After seeing all the experiments and nightmares they were responsible for, I came to believe that there is no God. Instead of revealing truth myself and risking your life, I'll choose to vanish forever. Still, please remember me if you ever read this letter. We came from across the wide ocean. I hope there is only truth in your life and leave your name here. I know people here call you Eugenie as their way, but that name will protect you. Please remember your real name. Your real name is Decipher of the Passcode Decipher's Damage, so it's unrecognizable. That's interesting. Okay, so.
I heard it from a recent arrival. Alidoro is dead. I know he's a fake, so it doesn't matter. Still, I wonder what happened to the real Alidoro. The one who saved me. I shudder thinking about it. Do you have any ideas? Hmm. I wonder what the real Alidoro was like. I'm gonna tell the truth. What? Wait, I'm confused. Wh what are you talking about? An older brother? Uh, this letter sounds like it could be my brother. The part where it says, We are from across the wide ocean. It sounds foolhardy to jump to conclusions. But it also fits with what happened at the workshop tower. Uh, sorry, it's just so sudden. I need some time to think. Damn. You're here. Sleuthing. My older brother's mark is part of the decryption. He used a mark of the country of the morning. I have no choice but to believe it's real. After all, we are the only people here who would use that mark. Why did my brother leave? What could it mean if he knew the secrets of the alchemists and Krat? <laughs> I'm so angry. Does he think he's better than everyone trying to protect me from a distance? He could have at least said something. Mm. All I wanted was a chance to meet my real family. Mm. <laughs> it, sorry, I'm just grumbling. I should thank you for uncovering this secret that matters to me. This was precious. It's the only thing my brother left me. And now I'm giving it to you. You showed me the truth after all. And that's priceless. Um, yeah, I got the achievement. Oh, why? It's, a, it's a, uh, a song. Oh, my thorn pierced heart, my soul. But remember again the song of the sea, the breath of the soul. There lives a wolf in the northern tower. If you kill this wolf, a flower grows from its heart. <clears throat> The song of the boy who left on a long journey to propose to the girl. Proposal Flower Wolf. I always welcome. 